Hello guys, and welcome back! We are on part two of our Hunting Shinies series. So, of course, we're going to move on to the next box of Shining Legends. Um, what I may actually do, I'm debating it, I might do two boxes at once. Just for the fun of it. So we can mix and match the packs inside and see which cards we pull. So this is going to be very fun. Hopefully it's not going to be too long of a video for you all today. I'll see if I can fly through it relatively quickly. So of course, if you haven't checked out my first starting video, uh, part one of course, uh, then I'd urge you to do so because we pulled some amazing shinies and of course we got some awesome GXs that we were looking for. We're still looking for that Shining Mewtwo, which is going to be the one card we're after. Hopefully we managed to grab it in all of these packs, so let's just mix them up. And that kind of does. That will do. Right, and we shall begin. So of course we have the Shining Mew on the front of the box. Front of the box, front of the pack. And let's see what we can pull. Hopefully we don't have any duplicated shinies. It'd be great to get a set without duplicating any, but we can only see. So we have the energy switch, the, I keep thinking minus all, but of course it's not. Whatever that dude is. And we have a palakir to start us off with. So I've kept our hollows to the side from our previous box. And probably throughout this series, it's going to go higher and higher. What I may do after this pack is cut all the packs open just to speed the video along a little bit. And we can see if we grab anything quickly. I'll be back in two seconds. Right, and we're back people. So we have all of the packs open and ready. Hopefully it should be a lot quicker for everyone to watch. And it takes me forever to open a pack, but we'll see how this one goes. So we have a Gullet. Uh, I still don't know what that dude is. And we have a Palkia to start off this new regime as such. Oh, it seems I'm terrible at cutting packs. Right, I guess it's better to cut towards the top than it is the bottom. I'll stick to that excuse as such. We have a weird looking Jinx there. And a Raichu GX. That's looking very nice. So our first GX pull there. Which is always a beauty. Hopefully we've managed to get to that Raichu GX Hyper Rare. Oh, this cutting is atrocious, man. Come on, let's see if we can get our first shining card of the video. We have an awesome Bulbasaur, we have a Perleon, and we have the Verizion Hollow. Of course, we're going to have a lot of duplicate hollows in these sets, or from this series as such. Like we did with To Have Seen the Battle Rainbow, I managed to pull, I think, 98. And we have a Shining Celebi to start us off. So another one we didn't have from the last video. So a perfect start for us there. Get in, you bugger. What a wonderful looking card that is. So awesome start. We have three more Shinings to find. We can do that here. And starting us off, we have an Ultra Ball. That dude. This dude. Electrode. Let's do 
don't even know what that dude is. And a Latios Hollow. I promise for the next video I'll actually know what these dudes actually are. That would actually be helpful. Uh, that minus all dude. Go look. Insane Raw and a Raikou Hollow. Love the hollow effect on the hollows themselves, it's just they're not exactly worthwhile as such. So we have this poison dart thing, Totodile, a Pikachu, a Lovesta, I think it is, Torkoal, and a Zekrom Hollow. Again, the oil effect are. Oh god, this cutting is shocking. The oil effects are very nice on the hollow cards, it's just. The only ones worth collecting are the Japanese exclusive promos. So, for example, the Pikachu cards. We have, we have the Pikachu Vulpixes and the Poncho Pikachu cards. And we have a Hooper. Of course, if you're collecting sets, then the hollows are desirable. And we have a double colorless energy. Go look, a Plusle, Ivysaur, that Shroom dude, and a Palkia. Oh, that curtain's actually on point. Nice start. And we have an energy retrieval. No, oh, I don't know what you're called still. Quillfish, Sunfisk, and we have a Volcanion. Shiny, or Shining Volcanion, just to say. Which looks very, very nice. And you can see the sparkle on that one, that's beautiful. Another one we don't have, so that's another one ticked off the list. Lob you with a Celebi, my friend. Two more in this video. And of course, a lot more of the GXs to come. And let's see if we can pull some. So we have Litten, a Voltorb, and Seenroll, that dude again, and a Rashiram. Oh man, your cutting skills are dodgy. Right, got lots and lots of rubbish around. And we have an Ultra Ball. Oh, I don't know what you are, or you, a Scraggy. An Electrode and a Evoltol Hollow. Still lacking on those GXs, got quite a few packs remaining, but it seems odd that we've only had the one so far. A Scraggy. Electro, Scrafty, Scraggy. Volcanion and a Keldeo Hollow. Oh, it's trying to get away. Get up there. Oh, this cutting. So much for speeding things up. It's kind of half worked as such. So we have this dude, the Pikachu. Uh, shroomish, I'd like to say, but I'm not sure. Weird looking Jinx and a Latios Hollow. Mm. So I'm just going to move all of this. Oh, I'm getting bulk here as such. And you know how much we like our Japanese book. And let's go. Still don't know who this dude is. Perleon, Ivysaur. Leopard, I called you Perleon before. Venusaur, and of course, there's the Zoroark GX. So that is this bad boy. I completely forgot this dude was in the set. So there's Zoroark, Entei, Raichu, and Mewtwo, if my memory serves me correctly. So good old lovely Lily, a Perleon again, Voltorb, Golurk, True Master, and a Shaman. Wouldn't that be just amazing if Pokemon named him Shroom Master? As opposed to whatever the hell he is. A Lavastar, Totodile, a Torkoal, 
Sunfisk and Marshadow. I say slightly guessing. And how? Fossil, Bulbasaur, Gollet, Feraligator, and a Manafi Hollow. That one's got the best hollow pattern that I can see. It's a very distinguishable hollow pattern. And it looks as though we are halfway through the packs. We still have this annoyed little child, Scraggy. And we have it. We have got the Shining Mewtwo GX, or just the Mewtwo GX, the ultra rare version. And if you can see, and the light there, you can see his incubation chamber shining as well as the card itself. Oh, what a beautiful card. And awesome to pull it in the second video. That means that I have to open every single box just to find this dude. That is truly spectacular. So get with the Shinian's brother. And that's awesome. So I believe there's eight Shinings. We already have, maybe it's nine. We already have four, five. Oh, I'm losing count already. We already have five. Of course we do with the Mewtwo. And there is, of course, the, the promo ho -Oh, which we also have, which I have somewhere around here, which I have to show you in the, the next video, perhaps. Good old Scrags, and we have an Entei GX, another lovely looking card, starting to run out of the sleeves, which does not help at all. Love you up there, dude. And what would we like next as our Shining card? Just trying to think what we have. We've had the Celebi and the Volcanion. That's a good old Oveltal there. Completely forgotten what we have now. Where's my phone? So we have here the, of course we have the Arceus, the Rayquaza, Lugia, Jirachi, Mew, uh, Volcanion, Genesect, I forgot about Genesect, and Celebi. So there is one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. And of course, the Mewtwo GX down at the bottom. So, eight to collect. Nine to collect then. Nine with the Mewtwo. Which we are already five down. So, four left. Bloody hell, makes maths look hard there. We have a Litten, a Volcariana, a Leopard. And a Shining Celebi. I'm pretty sure I just pulled this. We did. So we have two of the Shining Celebes. So there is our first duplicated card. Which is a shame, but we cannot complain at all. I can pick them back up now. I'll be over there, dude. Moving us swiftly along, we have one more Shining remaining. And we have a Bulba, a Quillfish, a... still don't know where you are, Crazy Jinx, and a Verizian Hollow. Oh, this dude's going to annoy me. I need to figure out who he is. A Lovester, Quillfish, Leopard, a Venusaur, and a Latios Hollow. You can see our Hollow stack is picking up quite considerably. That will no doubt double when we open the next few boxes. 
I still know. I think it's Pokemon Catcher. Ivysaur, Voltorb, Sunfisk, and a Shining Mew is our last Shining of this box, which looks very, very nice. And you can take my last sleeve. So there's our last Shining. And I believe we already have one of those in our first video. So we're already on duplicated Shinings. Of course, we already have the Celebi from the same, well, say same box, same opening. Totodile, Incineroar, this bloody dude, and a Raikou Hollow. We still need to find some GXs, so hopefully we can get the last card we would like. Of course, other than the Shinings, is the Hyper Rare Raichu. And if we can find this dude, then that would be epic. Hopefully we have some great Shining, great Shinings, great GXs in the last few packs. Oh, cool full art would be cool. Nice Entei full art. Anything, anything cool would be good. Another Shining. Even though it's not really possible, we have another Zoroark GX. So that is GX number four. And you're going to have to have one of these Ultra Pros, dude. So another Zoroark GX. Let's go there. I'm not too sure if we're going to pull anything else. So that's GX number four. We can only hope, though. So, double colorless. Pikachu. Scrafty. For Koreana. A Mental Drinks. And a Mar Shadow, I think. I say optimistically hoping. We're still looking for that Hyper Rare. Come on. This dude again. Cool Fish. Ivysaur. For Koreana. That dude again. And a Shaman Hollow. So we have a Great Ball. A Litten. Oh, I don't know what you are. Or you. Quillfish. And... Rashiram. Christ, yes, of course it is. So we have a double colourless energy. A... I don't know what you are. Scrafty. Venusaur. Scraggy. And a Mewtwo GX. That's our second Mewtwo GX of the video. Of course, we got the awesome incubated Mewtwo GX, which was the one we were after. And there are three more packs remaining. Hopefully one more GX, so three per box would be very nice. I think we already had six. So we already had three per box. With one ultra rare being the Mewtwo. I lose count very easily, it seems. Do we have How, Gollet, Totodile, Bulbasaur, for alligator and a Verizian Hollow. Where are you trying to go, buddy? Down to the last three packs. And we have an Energy Retrieval, a Voltorb, Ekans, Crazy Jinx, Leopard, and a Keldeo Hollow. Come on, something tasty at the end. Very tasty. So, this dude, this dude, oh, these dudes are awful. Um, Perleon, this dude. Hey, we do have something awesome. We have a Raichu GX. So, again, it's probably the second one of the video. I think. I say, thinking we've already had one. Let's have a little check. We have already had one. So we have our two Raichus, and I'll do a little recap at the end, because we have one more pack, which will no doubt be a Hollow. 
We have a Lily, Scrafty, Plusle, Arbok, no idea, and a Manafi Hollow. So of course this is what we did get from these boxes. We have two of the Raichu GXs, a Mewtwo GX, two of the Zoroark GXs, and an Entei GX, and of course all of our Shinings from the box. We had the Mew, or the Shining Mew, looking very nice. Shining Celebi, another Shining Celebi. This awesome Mewtwo, which just looks spectacular. And the Volcanion, or the Shining Volcanion to finish. So, thank you very much everyone for watching part two of this uh, Hunting Shining series. Um, I'll be back, of course, to open up, what do we have? We have four more Shinings remaining, so hopefully at minimum two boxes, but we could do four to get the last four Shinings. So be sure to check them out, and I will catch you guys in the next video.